teach you guys how to teach your dog the name chasing game. It's a very simple game, but it is how I start teaching a recall to a dog so I can get them coming to me the first time that I call their name. Some things to keep in mind about your recall. Pick a word that your dog doesn't hear a lot. For my dogs, I pick their name first, then I use a secondary word like here later on in our progression of our games. If you use your dog's name a lot during everyday life, pick maybe um, a nickname for them or a different word that you're not gonna overuse. If they're hearing their recall word too often without it being followed with a reward, they're gonna start ignoring you and you'll have to pick a new word and start over. A couple other things to keep in mind about your recall. Don't call your dog to you with their recall word if you're gonna do something they don't like. Ending playtime, a bath, nail trim, ear cleaning, medication. Um, basically anything they may find a little bit punishing, where as we maybe think it just is necessary. Avoid using their recall word. Instead, it's better to get them if you can. Oh boy. So, in order to teach this little game, what I'm gonna need are two different treats. I'm gonna need a lower value and a higher value. So I'm just using kibble. I'm gonna use the lower value as the actual kibble and then the shredded chicken. Um, actually, I think this is lamb as my higher value. And it looks like we have a cat who's gonna play with this as well. So in order to start this game, I've got my two treats. Come here, Mango. Good boy. And I'm gonna start with my search. So I'm gonna say search, toss a cookie a little ways away, Mango, and run away from my dog while watching them. Come here, buddy. His climb is there and we've been practicing it a lot. So I just brought him over to me since he forgot about the game we were playing together. So let me show you what it looks like one more time. Sir, I don't need you on there, thank you. Good boy, let's just do that, good boy. So I say search, toss a cookie a little ways away, bingo, run away while watching my dog, good boy. I know, you're looking for that climb, good boy. One more time here, search, toss it away, bingo, run away while looking at my dog, color grab and reward. That was perfect, buddy, good boy. So what I wanna start doing is adding some motion for my dog. Now, if I always call my dog to come square on like this, my body is actually saying stop instead of come with me. So by just simply turning your body and running away a little bit, your dog is more likely to follow along with you and it'll make the game more fun for them. Anytime you can make recalling fun for your dog, they will do it more often. So just have fun playing this, keep it super simple. When you're ready for a little bit of a challenge, add some more distance, add some turns, um, maybe you run around your counter in your kitchen or you go hide behind a wall. Um, anything you can do to make this game really fun for your dog because it is so easy, your recall will be better. So I hope you guys have fun playing. Let me know if you have any questions.